Hello guys and welcome back to the next episode of Another Brick in the Mall with me, Biffa. Thank you very much for joining us. Um, something that I've noticed on here, which is actually quite handy, is these little symbols down the bottom here. Missed sales opportunities, parking, we don't have enough parking, and queues full. Customers are leaving the store because the checkout queues are full. Add checkout counters and hire more cashiers to milk them for all they're worth. So we know about that. So let's right click to dismiss those. So we've got into more parking spaces built here. I'm going to see whether we could even fill up that one there. It won't let us. That's too clear, too close to the end. We've got a new road that's being built here, but I'm wondering whether we should extend the road up here and fill this with customer parking up there down the side and then we can start i mean this i think we could end up having a big customer car park in here that might be good i don't know whether there's any problem with walking too far to get to your let's speed things up to get to your car or anything like that or oh, there's lots of cars coming in so we'll see anyway we could probably do with I'm into more builders. So let's have a look. Staff. Uh, zoom. No, it's not that one there. Build. Where do we go to get more builders? No. Oh, oh, oh. Didn't mean to do that. Maintenance centre. Let's put that back. There we go. Council. Let's do it that way. Yeah, there we go. Excellent. We remember. We remember. Uh, How's our research going on here? 22 hours left of restrooms. So that could be good. I mean, I've sort of picked that one. Just assuming that's something I want to do. What are these guys going to say? Queues for parking. Okay, let's just slow this down a bit. We do have two checkouts. But we don't have enough people. Why do you not go up to here? Why do you all queue here? Because this checkout is open. Days employed one. Maybe because she's only just turned up. I don't know. Maybe, maybe. Right, let's uh, let's have another look up here. Still, fast food is the biggest thing that people want. I just want to get some more staff. Uh, Story maintenance staff. Here we go. Janitor builder. Let's get janitor. Janitor cook. Anyone who's particularly good at building. Patience. This one here. I think we'll have him in. And we'll have him start at night, so we can get building straight away. Have him start at 21, so he comes straight in. Excellent, and we'll hire one more builder. Let's have a look. You'd be good as a janitor. I mean, I don't know whether we could change you later. Let's start you at 2200. There's a little bit of an overlap, but we want to just get stuff done, don't we? So... There we go. That's good. Right. Let's add in here. Uh, customer parking. That's the one I'm looking for. All the way. All the way down there. And we will put it along here as well. Once they finish this piece of road. Let's whiz this along a bit. There we go. I mean, I want a couple of... Yeah, excellent. We've got three builders working at once overnight. Just what we need. Finish this bit. Yes, there we go. We'll do that all along there. That should be okay, and that's not too far to get into the shop. So hopefully that will help. Good, good. We can also put some plants and things out here. Look, we've got objects. Let's have a look. I saw some nice plants. Pinball machine fountain. Hmm, okay. Well, we could put some plants either side of the door. Can we not? No, we can't. We can't put plants outside. Oh, okay. Fair enough. You're going to stand around because you've got nothing to do. We could just put some more parking in. Why not? Road work, customer parking. Could that end up being a car park? There you go. It's going to have parking all the way along there anyway. I'm thinking of doing like a big square. Another road there, more parking, just sort of going like that. We'll see how that goes. In fact, if I add another road and go along... We can see if we sort of can make this. So we need another road coming down there. So not there, but there. If 
if we take that out and put a road there, there we go, customer parking, oh they can't do that yet, let's speed up, let's try and get this done before they all go home. Okay, what's that telling us? Useful, yeah we know about that. Oh, useful, so they're only queuing on one. We need to get more checkout staff in, don't we? Okay, let's leave those going. Oh, it's because it's too close and nobody can get in there. Because they're queuing up there. I bet that's what it is. I bet that's what it is. Um, remove wall. Oh, hang on. Oh, no, they are working in there. Look, they are queuing up there. Good. Oh, okay. Oh, well, at least we know that works. <laughs> Look at their faces as they get angry for queuing. Oh, okay. They'll overlap each other. That's fine. That's fine. But we could do with... Some more checkout staff. Hire a cashier. Who's really good at as a cashier? You. You look very good. Speed, patience, sociability. You've got the works. Let's get you coming in at 1 o'clock, which means you'll come in pretty quick. Good. I was hoping that would back onto here. Is that going to change? If I add some more down there like that. Let's see which way that faces. I was hoping that we're going to sort of face towards each other or face outwards the same way. Let's see, let's see. They're almost done. What's this saying? Useful. Yes, I know, we're working on it. I'm getting my car parking done first. Got 143,000. Objective, sell 20 different types of products. Oh, we're almost there. Uh, what product do we not sell then? So how many is there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Oh, there we go. Pet food. Are any of these doubled up? No. So we need to change that shelf there. I hadn't noticed that. So let's remove that and that. Let's not remove that. Thank you. And then we will put in an object. Let's find the shelf. <laughs> Not the way they're looking around the place. Makes me laugh. Oh, well, let's put in some of these as well, look. Looking very nice. So what a normal food shelf to go there when they finish building. Oh, there we go, look. Oh, I see, that's backed onto that part of the road. Yeah, that makes sense, that makes sense. And we'll just finish off on that one there. Is that going to finish his parking? Excellent. Yeah, that's looking good. And then we'll do the same going up there. We have room for expansion. Right, I want this removed. Here she comes. And, yeah, let's put that in. And then we'll get our last item. Oh, it's night time, is it? Suddenly, what's the time? Yeah, everyone's going home. What time is the store open till? I mean, we could have that open till 10. Do we have enough staff to cover that? Probably, yeah, we do. Yep. Yeah, you start at you start at seven. You start at eleven, twelve, and one. I'm going to start you at seven as well. Yeah, that'll be good. Has that shelf been done? Let's pick the one product we don't have: pet food. There we go. Now we've got to sell 30 different products. Okay. Have 100 customers on site. We've had 30. Oh, that's easy to see. Missed sales opportunities. Oh, project complete restrooms. Nice. So we can finish off searching this one here. Get some more products in. That's good. And we can assign as a restroom that one and that one. Um, I'm wondering whether... I mean, I've made two, one for male, one for female. I'm wondering whether that doesn't make any difference at all, and that just, everybody just uses it. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, let's finish off this car park while we're here. There we go. Because we've got some builders doing nothing. And then we'll have another road go down there eventually when we need to, which we don't need at the moment. Although, I may just get them to finish that bit off. And customer parking. Oh, when that road's finished. Yep, yeah, that'll be good. I'm liking the plants there. <laughs> Why not?
It's looking good. Let's add a few more plants in. I think that's plant type A. Yeah, let's... Oh, look, we need a janitor. We don't have a janitor, as far as I'm aware. Uh, stock clock, stock clock, cashier. No, that's not the one we want. Maintenance. Builder, 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 builder. Hire a janitor. Right, who's going to be good as a janitor? Stephen Lyons. He's 18. Let's hire you. There we go. We could probably get him to come in late at night and clean up. And sort of clean overnight instead. I mean, I don't know how much money we're spending here. Oh, profit is going up. Fantastic. There we go. They've nearly finished. Uh, we want to build that last customer park in here to finish off this little section when that's done. Don't disappear now. There we go. And we can do one there as well. Good. I'm pleased with that. What's the time? Six oh, it's going to be opening up anytime soon. Here they go. They're all rushing in. So let's look at our research. So we're going to get fresh fruit, veg, meat, fish, milk, dairy. I'm assuming we can add all of those to here. Which will be really nice. We need some extra products. Yep. Let's get rid of that. Sell 30 different types of products. We're getting there. We need 10 more. They're nearly done building. Okay, so what are the people's needs at the moment? This one here. Still fast food. Um, what can we research to do with fast food? Alcohol license. Night hours. Allows opening at night. Maybe not yet. Chemical clothing. Restrooms we've done. Bowling cinema. Road network one. Allows connections to additional road entrance. Oh, right. Okay. Frozen food supplier. I guess we've got to do this one here first. Okay, so... I think we can add to restroom three and four. That's fine. I'm just wondering whether... Oh, garbage pickup. What's that? Oh, we don't have one of those, do we? Um, Should we perhaps have... Do we need one of those? Maybe. Let's add a road here. I'm wondering whether, actually, we should have that round here. If we have a road going up there and have our garbage pickup behind here. So I think we could do with expanding this out now. So I'm just thinking what other sort of shops and areas we can have. What tasks do we have? Let's see if we can do one of these. Sell 30 different types of products. Well, we're not far off researching this 75 out of 96 hours so 21 hours left and we're going to get fruit veg and all that sort of stuff so we need to set up an area for that i think over here um let's look at this actually i think these are going to end up moving um instead of being always at the side there oh, we're not running out of parking anymore which is good 100 customers 500 sales and hopefully our cleaner is going to arrive. Oh, he's going to work tonight, isn't he, and start doing that. So maybe let's have... Nope, that's not what I want to do. Let's go for foundations. There we go. And add, like, another room over here I think would be quite good. Let's speed this up. Get them working on there. Let's do that one. We can have our rubbish collection over here, weren't we? So let's add that in. Uh, a sign. Uh, which one's that under? Roadworks. There we go. Garbage pickup. Maybe attach that one to the side there would be good. Yep, we shall see. And we're going to want to remove some of these as well, aren't we? So... I wonder if I remove this wall. That's going to mess all of this up. I don't think it will. Let's give it a go, anyway. How's the parking going? Plenty of parking space. They're choosing this. Not many people are using the bathroom yet. Which I thought maybe that would be sort of like a given. That people might want to use when they first, first come here. We're making more money. I am wondering about getting, getting some more builders in. How's our finances going up? Profit over the last... Okay, we're making a lot of money. Parking usage, sales, things are increasing, which is good. Oh, yep, yeah, that's going well. 
12 hours left. Well, let's keep that going. Let's get that research done. And then maybe we can have like a little fruit and veg area over here. And how's our storage been going as well? Current, so we're going to need some bigger storage at some point. We could add a little storage section on the side here, couldn't we? Perhaps. There we go. Got our rubbish collection from there. Fantastic. Then we're going to remove that. We could put some more shelves down here. Or I might... Do you know what I'm going to do? There we go. You're working. Good, good, good. Let's just slow that down a minute while we do this. So, assign... I want this part of the same store, I think. I don't want to do a separate store. Oh, we can do a ticket lobby. That's not going to help us yet, is it? So let's do part of the same store. If we do that, yeah, there we go. The whole thing is store two. Fantastic. Apart from where the wall used to be for some reason. I don't know why. And then let's build objects. Let's go back. Oh, actually, how much research have we got left to do? Five hours left. I'm just wondering whether to get that finished first. And then we can see what sort of shelves we need to build the items that we've got. We'll probably end up having a door. Or maybe opening up this bit. I know we're sort of building walls that we're then getting rid of. but And there we go. We've completed the project. We now have all of these produce. What I want to see is, is what sort of shelves they need to go on. So, fridge will take milk, dairy, fresh milk. Okay, well, let's get some of these in here then. So, we're going to have milk in there. Dairy in there. Fresh meat in there. I think what I'm going to do is remove... Actually, no, I'm going to leave those there. Let's put in some objects. Uh, fridge. There we go. Yep. Three more like that. And then we can put the other objects in. Have we been given anything else? Cookware. Uh, anything else for these ones? Cookware, they're the same sort, aren't they? Let's do this one. No, so we need one more of these as well. So let's add one of those in. There we go. Excellent. What have we got left? Fresh fish. Or maybe just do that one and then we'll add this one. Product on shelf. Cookware. Excellent. So we're now selling 21 out of 30. I thought it'd be more than that. Oh, now our storage is filled up. Oh no, 10, 11, 12. We've got three more left. Phew. So what should we go for next? I mean, the alcohol license. We've done a little bit of that. Night hours. One of the needs that we've got here is fast food. And what's that one there? Fresh bread. So we could have a baker's fresh fish. So we could actually separate this off into a separate store and have that as a baker's perhaps. Um, let's have a look. What have we got? Frozen food supply. We've got a few more coming there. Now that we've got this one, we'll be able to do that. Is there anything along the line of bakers? Um, night hours, chemicals, clothing, electronics, media, appliance, tools, luxury. Restrooms we've got. Restaurants. Oh, maybe not. Well, maybe let's unlock something like restaurants then. And see what we can get there. Let's go for that one. Because that was one of the other needs. I'm assuming fast food is going to come under that. So, 96 hours left for that one. This area up here is going to be our restaurant. Once we have... Oh, what's happening down here? Q's full. I keep getting this Q's full message. We have her. This lady working here as a cashier. And nobody ever seems to go to her. I don't know why. So, I'm wondering whether we should just fire her. <laughs> let's just fire her. I don't know whether she's unhappy or... What's going on? But let's hire another cashier. Oh, she's back again. Hmm, I don't think we'll have her. Let's have... He's good as a builder. He's good as a cashier. Yep, Carl Patton. There we go. Uh, and you can work... How's everybody else working? We're all sort of working... Yeah, you can come in at 7. It's very busy. So, what I was thinking of doing is starting to set up some of the items that we need here. If we assign this as... Fast food restaurant, which is what we're going to get in a moment. He wants access. Well, we're going to have access. That's fine. Where's it gone? There it is. Requires cashiers. 
So it needs its own cashiers, so we can build some of those. Let's pop those in. Order counter. Checkout counter. I'm assuming that's that's fine. Oh, is that what that is? It needs... Oh, no, look. It's got space for the queue. Yes, that makes sense. There's plenty of space there. What is going on with this woman here? Her eyes were flashing and all sorts. So we'll have... Let's have that there. They can come in and they can leave. That's fine. I'm assuming it's going to need other things like an order counter. Let's see. We've got cashiers, stock clerks, fast food cooking ranges. Fast food warmer. Fast food cooking ranges. Okay. So, watch. We have these at the back. We'll have one there. I say one there. Like that. People can queue up and get their food. I'm assuming that's what they are. Uh, fast food cooking ranges requires order counters. Okay, there's an order counter. Yep, so they can queue up and order their food. So, I mean, it's, I don't know really. Let's put one there and one this side. I'm making this up as I go along. I've no idea. Uh, fast food soda dispensers. We can do that. There we go. Uh, won't let's place this object indoors. Is that not indoors for some reason? Uh, let's put this... Oh, that's where the wall used to be. I think that's a bug, you know. If you remove a wall, it doesn't like it, but... Uh, okay, let's have one of those. Fast food warmers. I think that's probably... We could do the same on the other side. Yeah, well, we're looking... <laughs> looking like it's organised nicely anyway. Requires cook and requires storage. Ah, oh, okay. Let's do a little bit of storage over here. I think that would be a good idea. So let's build a foundation. There we go. Yeah, that would be good. So let's get that one built. I think I've discovered why this one isn't working because we've got this section here which used to be a wall and I think that stops that one from working. That seems to me what it's going to be. Um, so I bet if we remove this object and remove that object and then put it in here, it will work properly. Let's get them to build... Oh, you're finished off that room. Yep, got some more builders. There we go. So then if we add in a checkout cashier here, there we go. See, yep, there's nowhere for that queue to go. It should go along here, but it doesn't. So we'll add it there, and then we'll have three for the cashiers. Okay, that's good. Well, any little bugs like this, we'll be passing them on to the devs. Let's stick in a door there. Good, good. And then we're going to assign that area as storage. Nice. And then if we right click. Oh, we've got to finish this research first. 57 hours left of research. And we're going to need some more cashiers and all sorts of things. So, yep, we'll be back. Ah, oh, and there we go. Just like I thought, now all three cashiers are working and we're making lots of money. And <laughs> some of these people. Let's slow this down a minute. It's. It's a shame we can't... Look, he's getting a bit angry about something. Now he's queued up, but we can't... Look, he was getting angry, but we can't always see why. Hmm, interesting though, interesting. Right, we've got a little bit of time to go before our research finishes. 43 hours. Right, the research is nearly over. I've just done a little bit of fiddling around here. Added an extra door, a door in and out here. Put somewhere for people to sit and eat, which I think would be a good idea. And some ATM machines. I think we've completed the project. Excellent. So we can now assign, as a fast food restaurant, all of this up to there. Excellent. And if we right-click on here, manage that, assign storage, that'll be that one. So that's open 9 till 5. I think that's that sounds good to me. So we need two cashiers. Let's see. She was fired before, so we don't want her. Brendan McGrath. Yep. And, oh, I didn't really look how good they were at cashier. There we go. Cindy Shorts, that'll do. And they're going to work 9 till... They're going to sort of overlap a bit here, aren't they? So maybe we could open this a bit longer. 9 till 7. 9 till 6. Otherwise we'll have no cashiers that will cover. Yep, that sounds good to me. Uh, we need cooks. How many cooks do we need? Uh, cooks so is up to us, I think. Oh, let's not build anything there. So let's hire some... Let's hire a cook. There we go. Who's a good cook? Nobody. Okay, Karen, <laughs> you're hired. Hire a stock clerk. Who's good at stock clerking? 
Okay, Camille LeBlanc. There we go. So we've got all their staff, and they will come in, and they will start tomorrow, I believe, that will open. Oh, stock's coming in. Here we go. Do we have enough space for delivery parking? I may just change this over here. Um, loading zone. That one. Hopefully that will just change. I left clicks on there. Whether the builders are going to do that? No, let's right click and get rid of that. And then left click. No. Darn it. Ah, found a way around that little weird problem once you've removed walls. If you select to build foundation and select your whole room again. Oh, okay. Well, I shouldn't have done it there, but they're now removing that wall. It will put in the foundations for you. I shouldn't have selected that wall section. We will put that wall back in again. There we go. We want that wall there. Please don't delete the door. Okay, you've deleted the door. <laughs> Thank you very much. That's very kind of you. Let's put that back in. But they're filling that all back in again. That's good. So I could do that there as well. Maybe that will fix it. And then we're going to have the restaurant is going to open, which is going to be fantastic. I don't think that's going to... There we go. It's going to add foundations in there. So now we could have another cashier here if we want, which we may actually do because... Although, no, we'll leave it as it is. We'll leave it as it is. So the restaurant's going to open today. Oh, we need to do our carpet. Let's put in the floor tiles. Let's fill that in. There we go. Lovely. And let's make sure the rooms are all assigned. Not quite. So this is going to be fast food restaurant. Bing. The whole thing. Excellent. And we've got more storage as well. So this should be opening up this morning. Oh, I'm excited about this. And it's coming up to 9 o'clock. The lights are on. Here come the staff. The cashiers are here. My cook is here. She's cooking. Excellent. Making some food. So I don't know whether we... Oh, look. Hello. The builder's standing around checking her phone. There's the work guy bringing the stuff around. Where's he taking that? Is he bringing that over here to stock that? He is. Excellent. So all we need is people to come in and to start ordering food. So... Maybe these people are coming in to order food. Who is she? What's she doing? Is she coming to pay? He, oh, is this our first food customer? Diane Fuentes. Former stocking clerk. Oh, she's come back. <laughs> oh, where are you going? Bringing meal. Oh, I see. You've ordered and it comes from there. So that needs to go behind here. These need to go the other way around. Okay, we've learned something there. I didn't know about that, by the fast food warmer. Oh, excellent. And now you're sitting down to eat. Oh, I'm really pleased with that. And that's working out really well. Let's speed this up a bit. So hopefully we're going to make some more money from this. And everybody's happy here, are they? No, he's going to go back. We, oh, there we go. I think we need to get more cashiers in at the busiest part of the day. I think that's the problem. Let's get one more cashier. Who's a good cashier? She was fired. No, we're not going to have you again. Uh, you were going to start at... You were going to start at 10, 11. Yep, that sounds good to me. So there we go. I think my restaurant and my little mini shop is working well so far. Oh, the lights are off. Everybody's going home. Let me know what you think in the comments. Would you like me to continue this series? I will go by what you guys say. I've been enjoying it. Um, I'd like to try out some of the other things that we're researching as well. There's a lot of stuff here to try. Um, so I'd like to work my way through that. But let me know what you think in the comments below. Leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit subscribe. There's always plenty of indie games coming up that I like to show off to you guys. And I will see you very soon for the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.